He's one of Tesla's biggest cheerleaders. Do you remain so if Elon Musk does indeed have to exit the company? Well, we're obviously hoping he doesn't have to exit the company, and we think there's very little chance of that actually happening. So we're not too worried about that outcome. Um, what we really think is this is the opportunity for the Tesla board to step up, and, and they need a strong COO. And we're calling on the board to take action, or else we're going to start moving to replace board members. It's, it's very important to understand that this is Elon Musk being sued for his own actions, not Tesla, the company. And now him not taking a settlement with the SEC, which I thought was very fair and reasonable, um, we, we see him taking a different path than what's best for the shareholders. And so it's time for us to do what's best for the company now. And that's build a bench around Elon. Just, you know, it, it has to be done. So, Raj, does that mean that you do not have confidence that Tesla's board, as it's currently constructed, is capable of making the best decisions for the company going forward? No, I've lost all confidence in the board. and I'm sick of them. I'm really, really embarrassed by the fact that they would let this situation get to the way it has and harm the shareholders when the SEC crafted a more than fair settlement for Tesla that would ultimately improve the company and be best for shareholders. And then he turns it down at the last minute. And that's where I draw the line. OK, you're not going to beat the SEC. You're not Mark Cuban. And it's time to grow up and put your ego aside and do what's best for the company. The company is doing phenomenally well right now. And this is so unnecessary. Who needs to go from the board, Ross? I don't know. I, you know, I'm going to have to do some analysis. We're writing a letter to the board and we're going to talk to our institutional friends in Tesla, you know, because the truth is, I think I could run Tesla better than it's being run right now. And, it, it, you know, that's what needs to be done. We need a leadership to to really step up here and build a bench around hmm. Elon. And maybe his job changes a little bit, but he's not going to be leaving Tesla and nor should he be. Are you personally disappointed in Elon Musk? Absolutely. I, listen, I've been in litigation in the past and uh, a lawyer, a smart lawyer, my brother, once told me, you're never going to be happy, you're never going to feel good and you're never going to win. So the only one wins is the lawyer. So yeah. just pay the fine, get out of this as soon as possible. And, and that's what I recommend to anybody involved with any lawsuit. You know, just settle these cases. That's what always happens. And so he's end up going to settle anyways for probably a worse deal. And it's costing us a lot of money today.